hanging out at the CMAs with one of my faves, Carly Pierce. Hi. Hi. No, I got to jump right into it because I got to tell you, I'm a big Christmas music guy. So two days ago, with another Christmas king, Michael Bublé, how was it? How did you guys get together and how was it to make that song? Oh my gosh. Well, first of all, I love him. And obviously he rules Christmas. And he just asked me to be a part of this song. And this song is so special because it talks about, you know, maybe the not so pretty parts of Christmas for a lot of people who experience grief or heartache or loss. Yeah, and I mean, at Christmas time, that's one of the most difficult parts. So how did you, why, why did you depict that to make a song about? He actually is the one that wrote it, and I really spoke to it just because I do think there's so many people that feel that way, that maybe this is a hard season of life. This isn't, you know, something really joyous for them. And they need to feel comforted and not alone. Well. Yeah, 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 of course. And now, during this time of year, outside of Michael, what's the Christmas song that you listen to? What's one of your go-tos? Um, all of Brett Eldridge. That's oh, what I love okay, so much. That's it. Yeah. I'm gonna go have to put that on my playlist. Ooh, the Glow album. Let's okay. go. Thank you for that. Yeah, it's good. And let's talk about presenting tonight. So, how excited are you to take the stage and be in front of all your peers? I'm so excited. Song of the Year is what I'm presenting, and it's a big deal. And there's really, really amazing songs that came out this year. So, I'm excited for all of them.